potato salad. All right, on a chef ricotta version, which I want to share with you guys this evening. Yeah, potato salad for Christmas. So I'm gonna show you guys how to make the best Christmas potato salad. So we got the board right here. All right, now I don't need to show you guys how to boil off your potato. So that's the potato which I boil off earlier. That's the potato. I boil off a little bit earlier. So I'm gonna show you. Potato, you just want to dice it this way. Don't make a potato overcook and be mush, like mashed potato. All right, you just want it to cook and keep firm. There's a secret of the way to do it and make it look like that. All right, then what we're gonna do, because it's Christmas. And a lot of people are doing things, all right? You can put sweet corn in it, but I think they shot them sweet corn when they like it. So we're gonna put some peppers inside of it, all right? Dice up some fine pepper. This is the sweet potato for Christmas, guys. All right, then that's some we call that red pepper. So I'm finally dicing up the, the peppers. Hope you guys can see. All right. So, so that's the yellow pepper right there. All right. And we're going to get some white one in and use the purple one in but I'm intending to use white one in this time all right so what you want to do you want to make sure cut up the onion finally chop up the onion not too large Chop up the onion to chunky, like you're going to fry it off. You want to cut it um, even, like some dices, medium size dices. So, That's how I cut the white onion. Yeah. 
so I don't want to be cutting it too um, large. Jen, big up yourself. Nice to see you coming on the show. I appreciate it. You know, never once leave us chef for cooking. And Esther Delicious, thank you so much for passing through in the building. Spring on it, not too chunky, just nicely. Yeah. Lovely. But as you guys can see, oh, that looking amazing. Next time, I'm going to be doing sweet potato one. It's Christmas and a lot of people are trying to do something this Christmas. So what we're going to do, I boil off some eggs. So we're going to dice the eggs then and put it in like that. Not too chunky. And as I said, there's always a secret of doing everything. If you want to get your stuff perfect. So that's one egg. You know what I mean? It's Christmas. And... A lot of people want to do something for Christmas. You know what I mean? Some people do things to impress their neighbor and all them things there. So you don't know you go already, their friend coming over. So your food have to look nice. Alright? A good vibes. So we use two medium sized egg in it. And those are boiled egg. That's not frozen egg. Guys, people I use frozen egg. Don't do that, man. Jed, do you use a frozen egg? I don't know if Esther, I think Esther is just was using it before. Too. Yeah, don't use a frozen egg, guys. All right. I know, I know they're making everything for putting it in the freezer, but <laughs> they've gone too far now, man. You know what I mean? Freezing the eggs. Up. Be careful when you go to the stores and buy them. All right. Jamaican black pepper. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. White egg is amazing. I'm thinking I'm getting allergic to egg. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But, um, Craig, what's going on? <laughs> Do you ever use a frozen egg, Craig? Let me know if you use it before. Because a lot of people are using it. You know? Yeah, man. Frozen egg. Let me know, guys, if you never used that one before. Got everything going in the freezer. You know? Alright, so we got. A few nice lovely ingredients right there. So we're gonna spark it up now and make you guys can see. So first of all, we're gonna go in it with some mustard. Cause mustard is nice. Little bit of mustard. Yeah man, please don't use the frozen egg. And you can't use frozen sweet potato frozen potato to make it. Hey, you know what I mean? Nowadays, ah, I buy the wrong thing. It should have been, um, oh, Craig, don't no, use the frozen egg. All right, good one. All right, look a bit of mustard inside. Now, what do you call this one? Mayonnaise. Um, light mayonnaise, all right. So, give it a little bit of mix, all right, guys. Yeah, don't use the frozen egg to make the potato salad, guys. It's not gonna come out nice like this, all right. Yeah, don't, don't not do that one, it's not gonna come out 
nice and lovely. All right, as you guys can see, you see that? Look at that. Let's try this. Mm -mm. Amazing. Very simple and effective. And that's a Christmas potato salad. Did complicate it. And it is very easy to make. So. Yeah. Please guys, do not use the frozen egg. All right. Yeah, man. Look at that, guys. Beautiful potato salad. For Christmas. Got mustard in it. You can put a little bit of salad cream if you like to. But take a good look. Wow. Amazing. Look at that, guys. Christmas potato salad from Chef Ricardo. All right. Knowing that you guys will be putting this on the table. So what we're going to do, as I said before, it's Christmas. You want to treat yourself. Please, please feel free. You know what I mean? Until January, you know? Yeah. Look at that. Let's put a little bit of color on top of it, you know? Some more spring onion. Just to make it looking lovely or nice. Look at that simple little potato salad with a little bit of garnish ready for Christmas guys now if you like this one you know exactly what to do you can put some color on it if you like to and you know <laughs> yes Jen brand new recipe for you you know what I mean so Christmas treat guys yeah I see I didn't give it a Christmas treat but do not go and get a frozen egg and use a frozen egg, all right? Yeah, I just got, no, oh no. You bag, all right. Thank you so much. Appreciate every one of you guys who are taking the time to support the progress of Chef Ricardo cooking. Yes, so we just did a beautiful sweet potato. No, potato salad, I'm going to be doing sweet potato salad sometime next week so look forward for that one i will be giving you another one like it all right 